Good morning people, if it's your first time around, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button and share the contents. Today we're talking about cheap food and where can you get it from. I'm going to do each view every night on different shops. Um, I've just had some locations here uh, and I've had unknown phone call, a uh, place called Aldi. Uh, really, really cheap. Um, so you got your baked beans, only thirty six, only thirty seven pence. Sorry. Uh, you go in the other shops, you're looking at what one pound eighty. Your chopped tomatoes, thirty eight pence. Your mushy peas, normal peas, thirty five pence. You got your tins of normal peas, thirty one pence. Top tomatoes again, 28 pence. So, looking good. Tin, t tins of potatoes, only 45 pence. Spaghetti hoops, if you've got any little siblings, 16 pence a tin. So, you can't beat that, like, you know what I mean? Uh, mushy peas, 30 pence. Sliced carrots, 25 pence. There's different brands and there's different names. But the way you look at it though, people, it's just a, it's just a name really, when you think about it. Look, it's edible, it's gonna be hot still. If you're that desperate to get food, and you're that, you can't afford too, too much of the price of what you value what you get, Edible, you're gonna eat it. A pack of Heinz beans itself is 349. So it's like halfy half where if you look back, you get your a tin of beans for 37 pence each, or a pack of four for 349. To be honest, I will get more value out of buying single tins of beans. Um it's the same as like your spaghetti. Your long spaghetti, only 35 pence. Your plum tomatoes, 28 pence. Uh, your red kidney beans, if people like that, but not my kind of thing, 33 pence. Um, beans and sausages, where you pay up the 80. 85 pence to one 40 yard in any other shops only 40 pence people 40 pence you can't have gone wrong Macaroni and cheese I used to get that before uh, But I couldn't because it was too much now what I'm saying the contents here is 55 pence how oh, guys Them little bits of loose change is what you have left out a shop Put it in your jaw, it all mounts up. So there's, there's, there's loads of other stuff. You've got your gravy granules for a tall tub. 300 grams, 95 pence. Tins of hot dogs, 59 pence. Other places they are, some places they are reasonable for the hot dogs, but there's some places where I've been, the eight yard pence each, and this for 59 pence, why cheap as chips, really. Chili con carne tins, chili con carne. Roughly, that's the same what you get in a normal shop, 39 pence. Some shops, there's about 150 yard. So you're saving a bit of change there. Uh, stewed steak, bit pricey, 179. So I'll shop about and I'll let you know back for that situation. Um, chicken and white sauce, 139, that is cheap because there's a place where I have been going and they've been nearly £2.10 pence. 
meatballs for the little little siblings, guys. Got your tomato ones or your gravy ones or you got your chicken ones. 59 pence. Oh wow. Corned beef. In other shops, it's only £3.50. £1.79. So that is good that if you if you're gonna if you're not looking for like the, a top brand name, if you just want the corned beef in corned beef to make some homemade pies or whatever, get a few tins, stock them up, make a little stockpile. That's what I've been start doing. Just think. Irish stew and chicken curry, 135. It's good stuff. It's good to stock up as well for all like that, and it's it's reasonable. Uh, mince and onion, that is cheap as well. Tins of mince and onion, one forty-five guys. Um, because I usually pay about one eighty to one ninety a tin. Big bags of uh, pasta guys, I've never been a fan for pasta, but I have been starting eating it there now. Um, and it's for a big bag, only 35 pence. Dry food, store that away. Get some shells, store it away. Uh, it's different brands. Um, strands of spaghetti, what you just boil in the pan and all, right, it just disintegrates. Only 69 pence. That'll, you know, maybe feed a few few people there, you know. There's different kinds of pasta. Um, so, up to now, it's canny. Lasagna sheets, 69 pence. That'll make a few meals out. The reason why I'm doing this for people is you don't have to like the page, you don't have to share the page, you don't have to subscribe to my page. I'm doing this to help other people who's on really low benefits at the minute and I, I know a few who is and they're struggling at the minute. And it'd be very nice of all you guys to share the contents, hit the like button, to build my page up but also to help other people who can't afford their food because there's more than us in the in this country who's striking private at the minute. But we all need to support each other to find the right kind of food for the right kind of people. So it'd be nice if you hit that like button, subscribe to my channel and share the contents and We'll get further in life by helping low benefits who's on income support universal because that is a downfall because uh, they're gonna half nearly half the universal credits soon. Uh, people's gonna lose out big time and it's 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 unfair really. It's not nice um, on people because all people want to do is just live the life like everybody else. Um, so basically, please share the contents to help other people, but also build my page up so other people know where to get cheap food from um, and stuff like that. And that's Aldi. So it'd be places, like Aldi places, it'd be... Uh, two seconds, guys. Down to one of my favorite 
bring my children back to this world. Um, so anyway, um, it will help build my channel, but also it will help a lot of people. Um, but I'll, like I say, Aldi, sorry there. Um, Aldi, um, is the one, uh, is, is, they're all dotted about Aldi. Um, there's one in Southern area. Um, I'm sure there's one in the normal Durham, County Durham. Uh, they spread all over really, uh, but up to now, I will be going to Aldi from now on because up to now, um, I'm going to still do my reviews on each shop because even if you have a deer out, travel to a few places, you'll get some good deals. Um... And it's in plus as well, it'll get you out the house as well. Uh, because these days you need to get cheaper food, but also you need to put money away. Because like I say, everyone knows with all the gas and electric what's going up at the minute, guys. And it's fucking rip off like. Scandalous. But nothing anybody could do about it. So I'm just giving you a heads up at the moment uh, for Aldi. Very, very cheap. And it's a must opening now. That's on a 10 star for me. Um, same as um, boxes of cereal, guys, for your, your little siblings or yourself or whatever. If you're not picky, go for the cheapest. Um, but at the end of the day, the way you look at it is, it's still edible. It's still cereal. It's going to taste the same. It's just a different fucking name, that's all. If you're going to be an arse about and, and spend nearly three pounds on a box of fucking frosties, probably that's your stupid daft look out, you know what I mean? Um, you got your brown flakes. Uh, 85 pence. Um... Honey hoops, 95 pence. Shreddies, 75 pence. Mm -hmm. But your cocoa pops, 85 pence. And them, and my little boss likes them, anywhere else, I'm nearly paying three quid for them, two fifty. So for 85 pence, that fucking, that's really cheap, that. Still like, like I say, um, sugar puffs, but instead of calling them sugar puffs, they're called golden puffs. Only one twenty twenty five, you know what I mean? So even that, like I say, that might that might be a consider for you guys. I got the mask because I like to see it. I'm, I'm not well. I've got the fucking flu, on there, so. Bags of usually one ninety nine. For a 1.3 kilogram. It's not bad. Got a lot of potential in this one, like. Rice crispy, 75 pence. So cornflakes, 199. I was have the 199 on it. Weight of bix, 169. So I like to see it, people. There's some good deals out there. And there's some not. Um, but I like to see it. I'm going to do a lot of reviews on each shop. 
uh, each night to find out which is the cheapest place. Um, but up to now, it's my first time on here uh, on the internet. Um, and was just getting a phone call earlier on um, about Aldi. I just thought, right, I'll go on and check the contents of Aldi um, to see if there is any good deals. In which, wow, what can I say? Aldi's got a lot, a hell of a lot of big deals on. Um, so bear in mind. If you're going to take about 60 quid with you, if you've got 60 quid, I should say, you're going to get your money's worth from all of these up there now, and you're going to come back with bags, a kind of few bags of shopping. Um, porridge, big bags of porridges for one kilogram, 70 pence. Coffee's is a bit uh, daylight, guys. Um, depends what kind of coffee you like. At the minute, I fucking, I'll drink, I'll drink any kind of coffee. What's cheap? But like such, like I love me Nescaf. But at the minute, Nescaf, as for Aldi, four pound forty nine. You might as well a fucking five quid for that's a two and a gram. Um. For the milk wise at Aldi, for a uh, 2.27 litre, it's 155. That's for the grain top, which I don't even drink the grain top, I can't touch the blue anymore. But that is fucking cheap because I'm paying £2. Uh, for the red top, same price, 2.2 seven liters is 155 so that is got a lot of potential in it as well sorry if you could hear the music in the background guys i've got me phil collins on there Killing out with you. Wine down time. Tea bags. There's different herbs. I've never fucking never heard of them before. You know what I mean. So uh, big boxes of Yorkshire teas, four forty nine. That seems to be the price on them is the same kind of price as I on of every shop really. Um, but all I'm saying guys is
help not just me, help other people. Uh, and the more people shares, the more people, the more people you're going, you're going to help out really um, for cheaper stock. But the only thing what I'm going to advise you guys is um, is to stock up your food there now, your dry food, your tin stuff. You go out there and buy your tin of beans, buy two, you buy four, buy eight. The way you look at it, stock up, so you've got a stockpile because it's, it's gonna, the food's gonna go up again. Um, and it's it's getting ridiculous the prices. There's no one couldn't do nothing about it. But if you stock up, you've always got extra food in. What's not gonna go out of date for one and for two, what's gonna help you over the Christmas period as well. My advice is get plenty of dry food in as well, such as like powdered potatoes, um, noodles, um, pasta, anything what's dry, what's going to last up, butter mix, dumpling mix, etc. You know the score guys, you know what I'm talking about. So. Hit the hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, please share me content. So build like I say, it builds me channel up. So it's not just you who's watching it. There's more people gonna watch it and people's gonna talk about it and people's gonna share them contents to help other people for food wise. Because there's uh, there's many people out there who's got loads of siblings uh, and if you're elderly, um who you're living on your own. It will help them as well, um, but also people who's got a lot of siblings, them's the people that need help as well because it, you know yourself, siblings grow up, they eat more and more, so all I'm saying is share me contents, hit the subscribe button guys, hit the like button, comment down below where you're from. Um, share your views on other places where you've been and prices um, and we'll link up and uh, we'll have a chat about it and uh, we'll help along with other people really um, so that's Aldi for you guys I couldn't go through the whole Aldi shopping list I've just looked on the laptop there um, just to give it a good round up and make sure we're that was true or not, you know what I mean? So it is true, guys. So tomorrow night I'm going to do a review on a different shop. So each night I'll do the contents, maybe it's about half an hour each time because I didn't want to bore, bore you is all, really. Um, so basically, um, I hope this part of this channel gets shared and I hope you all like the, um, what I've explained yeah, guys. Really, I'm not going to fucking video on myself here. But at the end of the day, my YouTube channel is going to get bigger and bigger. Um, and I'll get better and better. It's as simple as that. But at the minute, I'm in a good place. So, winding down. So, um, so anybody could comment? Subscribe, hit the like button, that'll be much for me guys, respect, and I'll get back with you, but my advice, start stocking up, if you're going to lose your coppers, change in your bottles, your purse, go out there and build it up and say right, make a hammer, even if it's for Christmas or over Christmas, build that up. Because with the cold winters coming in there now, and with the petrol and diesel and everything's going up, uh, it's going to go up again. Food's going to go up. Yes, don't get us wrong. Uh, over France, the supply over 10 million um, supply of potatoes to European, but uh, all that's going to get stopped. UK. Um, 
is going to we're going to still have potatoes in the UK, but prices is going to go higher. Are you going to willing to pay for them potatoes to go higher? Think, guys. Get the tubs or get the packets of powder potatoes. The cheaper, and you'll get more stock in. Potatoes only last for so long. Powdered potatoes in tubs, packets, cartons, they last longer. So think, people. Respect, and I'll see you soon. Over and out. You know what I'm talking about.